Hey, this is Adrian from the Alpha Project. We're over at Jaren's Gym, Savage Gym, and uh, working on a, se a video series of pressing variations. And uh, so the first one we did was a Larson press, and then we moved on to the incline press. Kind of, you can go back and review the video on how you incorporate those into your training. And today, we're going to work on uh, rest pause press. And the benefit, well, let's start with how you set this up. Uh, on a heavy bench day, go ahead and work up to three heavy sets of doubles without failing. And so Jaron had did that today. He worked up to 315, uh, knocked out uh, three heavy sets with kind of a real, almost a touch and go, a little bit of a pause. And, uh, and so we decided to do this rest pause press with uh, about 75% roughly of his max. And the idea behind it is we're really trying to put a, a lot of volume on him with heavier weight with just a little bit of rest but we're also going to pause um, each rep. Now the first two sets that he has done went up super easy like they should. It should look really good. It's light enough for him to make adjustments as, as he sees fit based on his elbows not coming up or not getting the proper leg drive. As the sets progressed into set three, four, and five, you could tell the bar was starting to slow down. The, having the pause press off of his chest was um, was kind of hindering him. So we we're, we're at that 70% mark, 75% mark, and we're working on pausing off our chest, slamming it up for doubles, five sets of that, and uh, we're taking roughly about a 15 to 20 second rest in between each set. So on a heavy bench day, work up to your doubles, complete your three sets, drop this down to about 75%, five sets, um, two reps, both of them paused. And you're, you're gonna almost do, um, a pause rep like a little bit longer than a competition pause. You really want to over exaggerated press off your chest. This is going to help with speed off your chest and as we've talked about in every video leading up to this, the one important thing is speed off your chest. Jaren, what would you think about it? Oh, it sucked. <laughs> <laughs> Felt good. It was nice to have a weight that was controllable. Um, still really working on that kind of same, same thing as always, heavy speed work. Um, that way there is actually some carry over to your competition bench because sitting and knocking out reps with 50 60 percent could pretty much do that hungover and i fend up i've hurt myself doing it that way the day that we made a joke about pressing too light i pressed too light trying to coach somebody and did it too fast and ended up straining my pec and was out for a couple weeks so i'm um, really just trying to keep the volume controllable and, and shift it to where i'm only doing heavier work um, and just kind of having variations of heavy um, it's been something that's helped quite a bit. So, yeah, it's all good. It's awesome. tough. Yeah, make sure you guys train harder, smarter, not harder. You need train, to train, both. You need to train both. Train both. Be, be hard and smart. And smart. <laughs>